everybody, it's Becca. So today I'm here with my weekly basket. I know it's not really a basket, but you know, it's stuff I'm going to use during the week. I got it from this acrylic holder from Whole Look. So I would put the link down below, but it's not there now. So next time, they have it on there. I will definitely put the link down there for you guys. Um, so, yes, I'm going to show you guys my weekly basket. So, let's go ahead and get started. So, before we get started, I want to tell you guys that I'm starting a new series. And it's called A Palette A Month. A Palette A Month. So basically, I'm going to use the palette for the whole month. If I don't like it, I'm going to put it in my run or leave, excuse me, leave piles and I'm going to sell it to you guys. So, let's go ahead and I'll show you it. This is the Urban Decay Naked. What number is it? Three. And guys, I've had this for, what, two years? I have not even used it. So, obviously, I need to use it. Like, I just, you know, I have so much makeup that I forget what I have, you know? So, this is what it looks like right here. If you don't know, I'm sure everybody has seen it before. And, um, yeah, I'm going to use this all this month. And then I'll let you guys know my honest opinion if I'm going to lust for it, love it, lust for it, or leave it. Let go. So there's that. Okay. So we're going to work away from the bottom up. And yeah. Let's go ahead and get started. The first thing I have here is from Bare Minerals. And this is called the Dream Sequence. And um. It's for eyeshadow, the quad, and as you saw there, a beautiful combination of purple colors. So here they are right here, on this side. And I had gotten this maybe two, three years ago, honestly, a long time ago. And that was before, um... I got my cancer and everything. So, I did do a video featuring a book that my good friend Samantha Sherman did. I'll put her link down below. I'm sure you all know and love her. But if not, go please go check her out. She's awesome. Um, so anyways, I did a look with that. I'll put link down below. I'm a lot bigger. <laughs> and... My camera is not as good quality as this here, but hey, you know, kids are done. So, if you're interested to watch that, I'll leave it down below. The next thing I have is this next. I'm sorry, that's my dogs. He'll be right back. My husband left, so they're all upset. My pug Dominic is all upset. Okay, so the next thing I have is the NYX Tulip Sick Blush. And I can't have had this. I used me once. Here's the color, if you can see it. It looked more orangey here on the camera, but it's like a hot pinky color. It is really pretty. So there's that. Again, that's in Tulip. Um, 
The next thing I have here is a cunning brush, blush that I've had forever and when I first came out I never even used it. This is the color Ginger Pop and again it's like more orange than it is in real life. Look at, oh here we go. It's like a corally orange color. I absolutely love it. So again that's your Ginger Pop. I got this from Shades of Cassie like at least two years ago. And I haven't even tried it you guys. This is so this why I wanna use it. This is from Sonia Kashuk. And I put my finger in. Oh no I'm good. Oh I dipped I think my finger in one of the shadows. It used to be very popular now, of course, I can't remember what it's called. Um, but here it is right here. It's like a dupe for a Chanel quad. But I'm going to use this one right here. And we'll see how it works. So, there's that. And then, the last thing for this bum drawer. I had in my previous weekly basket, but I didn't get around to it. It's the Maybelline Master Graphic Pen in black. And fancy that the Candace has mentioned this plenty of times. So I'm going to try it. Because I'm really bad at eyeliner. Especially cat eye. I want to try it, but you know, it's hard when you, know, you stink at it. <laughs> so, I'm definitely gonna do more of that this week. Um, next thing I have is from the second drawer. Oh, no, what to the top drawer? Um, Sorry about that. Okay, so the first thing here that I have is from Milani, and I have four pillow ashes I want to use. And this reminds me that I have to tell you something. <laughs> um, I was watching a, a new friend of mine, Leslie our lip gloss Leslie I'll put a link down below and um she inspired me in a lot of my decisions to use things this week because I saw them in her favorites and I thought you know what I have them why don't I use it so thank you Leslie because now now I can, you know, I can use this stuff until it's brand new. So, okay, the first thing one is bell cover. And this is the one that started it all. And okay, it looks more. There we go, it's like that color right there. It looks more orange for some reason. Or more yellow, but it's not. It's beautiful. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> My dog. <laughs> My dog just sneezed. <sighs> Let me tell you, it's my second time making this video. And whatever happens, happens. So, I apologize. Um. That's the next one I have is Bella Teal. It's this beautiful teal color and I can't wait to use that. Um, next one is Bella uh, Mandarin. Yes, Bella Mandarin. 
is this beautiful peachy orange color and again it's coming off yellow what the heck oh there it is right there it's beautiful and you would think oh that would look good on me P believe me if you put it in your crease it's beautiful the last one I have is Bella Bronze Bella Bronze Here it is right here. Beautiful. Love it. Okay. So now we'll talk about highlighters or excuse me about bronzer. Um this one I've had forever and you guys probably know if you watch my videos. This is the NYX powder brush blush. What do I keep saying brush for? You can see that my top broke, so I'm trying to keep it in there nice and safe. Hopefully you can see the color. It's a beautiful brown color. It's supposed to be a blush. Um, it's in the color taupe, if I have not said that already. And, um... Yeah, it's really pretty. I know that they have a new one, but honestly, I don't know if that is the same formula or not. Please let me know down below if you do know. This time I make my pug barking. Hey, Baba, it's okay. Oh, honey, don't cry. I think she's upset because Daddy left. It's okay. It's okay. Okay. The next thing I got from her look, and it's a Becca Mineral Bronzing Powder. Mineral Bronzing Powder. It's huge, you guys. Um, again, it's not coming off. Oh, here we go. There's a color. It's just a really pretty brown color. But it does have a little bit of shimmer in it. So I don't use it all the time, but I will use some of it, you know, this week. So there's that. <clears throat> Next thing I have is from Benefit, and it's the Dallas Plush. Dallas. Okay. And I don't know if I will be able to shade the inside. I'll try, but I'm not going to probably do the best. Here we go. That might work. There. It doesn't look like the color. Yeah, it's hard. Yeah, you can't really see it, but I'm sure you all have seen it before. I don't know if it's still available or not because I know that um, it's supposed to be limited edition because they're not going to make it anymore. So hopefully it's still available. So I would definitely check like Sephora or even um, Ulta. Let me put this back. I would check Ulta or Sephora to see. I have one more level left, and um, the first thing I'm going to talk about is this is from Tarte, and it's a gel liner, and it comes with a double ended brush. Look at that color, I love that color. Okay, this again I've had for so long, and they don't have any more limited edition, but I want to use it. Um, this is from Tar the Aquatics Eyeliner, and it, this is in Splash. I want to test it out to make sure it's so nice and, you know, now I try it out and 
it wasn't, so I'm going to use that. Um, the next thing is this beautiful NYX Prismatic. Let me open it here. NYX Prismatic Eyeshadow. I love the little bar right here. I think it's so cute. Here's the color in Fireball. Let's see if I can, there we go. There's the color. I am so excited to try this. Why does it look so orange on camera? It's hot. It's red. Here we go. So there's that fireball. And then I have, again, something I never use. This is from Cilla. I don't think I have them anymore. The Countless Color Pigments. This is an Encore. It's just so pretty, so I think I'm going to look with that. And then I went everywhere to find this when it came out. It was so bad. This is the MAC Kelly Osborne collection. Everything was gone in like five seconds, seriously. So I had a friend of mine. I believe her name is Alicia from Ma Place Well Makeup, my group I'm in, and she bought them for me. And she does not love me at all. So she said, oh here, call this number, and if they have it, they'll send it to you. So they did. I had to pay for shipping, but that's okay. It was worth it. I love this collection. So... I had three items from her collection. First, I don't know if you can be able to see this, barely, but it shows the, um, her signature autograph, whatever you call it. And here are the colors, hopefully. Yeah, there you go. Looks like that. Beautiful. Um... And then we had the blush in Cheeky Bugger. Cheeky Bugger. And here's the color. It's very, oh, oh, baby. It's like a very light pink, peachy color. This is probably the best I can do. This is the color. It's very light. I love it though. Whoa, baby. Let's put a dent in my blush. Oh no, see? <sighs> Sorry about that. And then, last but not least, from the Cut Osborne collection, I have this lippy. There we go. And this in the color Dashy Girl. Dodgy girl, and y'all know this is my type of color. If you know me, watch me. It's actually a lot lighter on the camera than in real life. In real life, it's like a boundary pink color. It's really pretty. So I'm definitely gonna be doing a look with all those. So, if you'd like to see that, please subscribe to my channel or even check out my Instagram because I'm sure I'll be up there. But certainly not least, we're going to talk about the top. Um, the first thing I want to mention is this Georgiana 12 hour made to last eyebrow eyeshadow pencil. Right here, and it's very messy, so I apologize. Here's the color, and it's like a um, it's just like a nude color. So I do want to use this for a um, 
I said primer. So, see, it's a hot mess, but there is that. That is a natural, I believe. Oh, continuous almond. I was so wrong. <laughs> Number four, continuous almond. Um, I do want to try this. This is an e.l.f. I like primer and champagne. I definitely want to try that. I got that from my traveling box I recently did. This I'm almost completely out of. The um, It Cosmetics Sissy Cream in medium. It's not even showing the true color. It's not a yellow. <laughs> I apologize. I don't know what's going on. But as you can see, I'm almost done with it. So, I had like maybe one or two uses left of that. I had this L'Oreal Visible Lip Blur Blush in 501 Soft Peach. And again, it's more of like a corally pink color. It's not like that color at all that you see. Um, I do have an eyeshadow I've had forever. I don't know if it's still is going to work. It's an eyeliner. And this from Caitlin. And I got it from my Ipsy bag. And it's really cool because it's got the brush on the top here. So here is that right there. It's beautiful, gray color. I don't have any clothes like that. So there's that. And then last but not least, we're going to talk about lippies. I'm so pumped because you all know my favorite thing to talk about is lipstick. The first thing I have here is the Specifica Color Quench Lip Tint Guava Berry. Here is that. It's beautiful. It's like a purpley tone to it. So I'm definitely going to use that. Um, the next butter gloss in Madeline is like this really pretty like brown color. And yeah, again, it looks like mustard on here. <laughs> but it's very pretty. It's like a very nice brown color. Okay. Um, I also have this Alme Lip Butter. It is a Smart Shade Butter Kiss in 50 Berry Late Medium. And honestly, I just got this because of the color. But I do have Late to Medium Skin Tone. So, here is the color. Really, really pretty. Okay. I have a couple more guys hanging there. I'm almost done. So the first one I have here is in Pink Lady. And as you can see, it looks like a bright orange. But it's not at all. I don't know what's going on. Why it's not. Showing the true color of my camera, so I apologize. But it's like a hot pink. And it's very... I love it. Again, it's Pink Lady. And you can find it on Ulta and stuff if you really want to see the color. <clears throat> and then the other one I have is... Play date, play date, 
and it is a very pretty like lavender color lavender lilac color and I'm gonna let a couple minutes on this so highly recommend that so my allergies are acting up like crazy today um I have two more things only two more can you believe it <laughs> This is brand new. I haven't even opened this yet. It's a Melania Power Lip in 04 Pink Lemonade. Again, does not look like that. It's like a strawberry red color. So I'm really excited to try that. So my next and final product is from Maybelline. Rebel Bloom. Look at the pack chain. That's so pretty. This is in the color Lilac Flash. Lilac Flash. Hopefully you'll see the color. Yeah. It's really, really pretty. It looks light on camera, but it's more of like a pinky purple. So, yeah. Definitely want to use that. So everybody, that is going to be it for today. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please thumbs it up if you like it. And um, <laughs> like and subscribe. And um, yeah, don't forget I also have a new blog. I have information down below. It's Becca's Chit Chat. Becca's Chit Chat chat so yeah thank you guys again for watching i love you all and i'll see you soon bye